What's going on everyone and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla build guide. Today I wanted to share with you a very powerful hammer build that is insanely good for fighting normal enemies or even high value targets. Before we get started I do need your help in reaching 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year by tapping that red subscribe button. Thank you so much for subscribing and let's get started. So in Assassin's Creed Valhalla there are plenty of weapons, armor, skills and abilities for to use and of course a lot of different combinations in doing so. One of my more recent favorite builds evolves around using a hammer and a spear with high crit chance. So I will briefly discuss the pros to this build before explaining what goes in it. Alright so probably the most important thing about this build is the fact that you can easily knock down enemies with your blacksmith hammer special ability which knocks an enemy down from a high crit attack. These are not 100% promised but happen pretty often which is why the hammer is in the secondary slot. Following up your knockdown with a stomp skill in your skill tree allows you to deliver some devastating damage and can easily be repeated on harder enemies. When raiding or fighting high value targets, I noticed that I would repeatedly knock them down, then stomp, knock them down, stomp, and then repeat until they were finished. Not to mention you can use the stomp ability from pretty far away and it's amusing to watch nonetheless. Stomp will deliver high damage to enemies so you definitely want to have it unlocked. Now in my main hand is a spear and this serves two purposes, one is to deliver fire damage prior to the engagement or during the attack, especially if it's a higher level enemy or right before the enemy has died. This will cause cremation to kick into effect which causes AoE fire damage and is perfect for fights with multiple enemies. The spear is also for ranged attacks where you may prefer fire range and cremation over a good old fashioned stomp. Now you could use a long sword or an axe but this spear is perfect as the attacks are long range in front of you versus being swung around which reduces range. Now the hammer itself, the blacksmith hammer comes with very high stun and crit chances easily surpassing 100 when fully upgraded which means the chances of you knocking enemies down when used is very very high. Since we have all 5 pieces of the raven clan armor we get an increased crit chance buff which also aids in us making sure that we're almost always going to land that heavy crit blow to knock down any foe. As stated before we do have fire strike equipped that is applied to our spear and then if an enemy is killed quickly they will cause aoe fire damage to others from the cremation. Since we are knocking enemies down applying fire damage and then stomping you will soon see that the fire damage is a huge bonus to this build. Also when using fire strike even though it is applied to your spear hitting with the hammer will apply the fire to the enemy as well. Alright so now that I explained some of the pros regarding the build let's go over what I use for my current build. For armor we are using the raven clan armor with all 5 pieces equipped to primarily get the extra crit chance bonus. Everyone should have this armor from the start of your England voyage, so a bonus there is that you don't have to go out and find all of the pieces. For weapons in the main hand we have the Gungnir, which is Odin's spear and an endgame weapon, however you could easily equip the Godfarch, or Godfarch, I don't really know how to pronounce that, but anyways that is another spear which you get from an art quest, or if you're not that far yet you could go ahead and find the feared spear which can be bought in Raven's Thorpe. In our secondary hand we have the blacksmith's hammer which is key to this build because its unique perk allows for heavy critical hits to knock enemies down to the ground every single time. You can find this hammer on the east side of London in a tower as shown right here on the map. Now for abilities we will rely on harpoon impalement, fire strike, rush and bash and then kick of tear. Harpoon Impalement is useful for pulling people into another hammer crit attack or your spear for fire damage before they do so, cremation can be activated. Fire Strike of course is going to ensure your spear has fire damage and can be applied to the enemy so when they die again cremation is activated. However you can only get this ability from Hytham and Raven's Thorpe upon delivering medallions from Zealots, but if you have not killed enough Zealots I would skip it for now. Russian Bash is a fun ability to make this build more useful for harder enemies. Then last is the Kick of Tear which I use if the hammer is not dishing out heavy crit attacks. This will definitely make sure they are kicked to the ground which then allows you to follow up with that stomp skill for cleanup. I will have another video available for getting these abilities in my playlist so if you're curious on where to get all of the abilities or you're looking for really good ones or recommendations you can go ahead and check out that video. Last of course are our skills. Now of course you will want to make sure that you increase your hammer damage, spear damage and have stomp and cremation unlocked. Stomp can be unlocked pretty early on as it's right above the center in your skill tree. Then cremation is at the top left as shown right here. Other priorities in your skills are fire, heavy damage, and then crit chance. However, because I'm such a high power level though, I have almost all of these unlocked, but if you don't, again, just focus on the ones that I already mentioned. Also, you will need a couple of adrenaline slots, 
you should have those unlocked anyways or you should be gunning for those either way because you want to make sure that you build up those adrenaline and then you can go ahead and release those upon your range in melee abilities all right everyone so that is my current hammer and spear build that is crazy crazy good for our ac valhalla i do hope you found this video helpful and if you did leave a like and subscribe for more thanks for watching everyone and i'll talk to you guys soon peace